Being in live video. Yeah, you're live. Okay. Hi, Facebook friends with Bot Radio Network. I'm Byron Tyler here with Mana Stafford, and we are here in Israel, Mana, back in Israel again for the second time. Isn't it awesome, Byron? I mean, we just had the most wonderful lunch, and this is a Druze village just outside of Mount Carmel. We're headed there next. Of course, we know Mount Carmel, what happened there. That is where Elijah defeated the prophets of Baal. Over 400 prophets uh, were defeated there when the fire fell, just burned up all of the altar of Baal, and we know whose God is God. Exactly. And we're here now with a wonderful uh, second trip with Bot Radio Network. And uh, we got in last night in Tiberias, right on the Sea of Galilee, and our adventure has started. This morning we were at uh, Megiddo, the valley, what the Bible refers to in Revelation, is the Battle of Armageddon. And what an incredible place, Mana. The uh, agriculture there what was, might surprise some people. Oh, my goodness. You know, when you're in the middle of the Jezreel Valley at Megiddo, and you look around you and you see all the farmland, that takes a lot of people by surprise, I think. Yeah, I think it really does. Well, we just had an incredible meal. Falafel is one of my favorite things to eat. And when you come to Israel, you can get some of the freshest, uh, most delicious falafel anywhere. So we were just here at this Drew's uh, restaurant. It's a family who has a restaurant right in their home. But it's got a lot of room for a big a bus like ours and other buses that have pulled up to be able to enjoy the meal. And so uh, fresh. This is the uh, name, Byron. Yeah. Uh, I love Dalat El Carmel. Okay. Mana is our official Drew's uh, interpreter and translator here. I'm going to let her do that. But listen, we're having a great time on our way up to Mount Carmel and uh, having a great time with Bot Radio Network. Keep it tuned right here to Facebook with Bot Radio Network for the latest updates as we travel to Israel. We'll be back.